Hey everyone, the world of trade is about to change in a big way. Israel, a country known for its smarts and big ideas, is planning something huge, the Ben Gurion Canal. This super ambitious project wants to build a new waterway through the Middle East, connecting the Red Sea to the Mediterranean Sea. This proposed canal, over 160 miles long, would be another way to ship things besides the old Suez Canal, changing how we move stuff around the world. The Ben Gurion Canal isn't just about digging a big ditch, it's a sign that Israel wants to be a major player in global trade. For Israel it could mean lots of new jobs and businesses, but it's not just about Israel. This project could change shipping routes all over the world, and even change who has power in the Middle East. This new trade route could be a real game changer. The Suez Canal is important, but it's getting old and can be easily blocked. The Ben Gurion Canal, with its modern design and smart location, would be a safer and faster way to ship things. If this big project happens, it would be a huge moment in history. It would show how clever people can be and how connected our world really is. The Ben Gurion Canal reminds us that even when things are tough, big ideas can still change the world. The Suez Canal is over 150 years old and a reminder of how clever engineers can be. This important waterway connects the Mediterranean Sea to the Red Sea. It's been super important for moving stuff between Europe, Asia and other places. It's changed economies and who's in charge around the world for a long time. But the Suez Canal has problems. It's only one lane, it can't handle too many ships, and it can be easily blocked. Remember when that huge ship, the Ever Given, got stuck in 2021? That stopped world trade for six days. It showed us how risky it is to rely on just one route for so much stuff. It cost a lot of money too which showed us that we need other ways to ship things. The problems with the Suez Canal are getting worse. Ships are getting bigger and there are more of them than ever before. This causes traffic jams and delays which costs money and makes it harder to know when your stuff will arrive. The Ben Gurion Canal, which is wider and allows ships to go both ways, could solve these problems. He, Ben Gurion Canal, named after the guy who started Israel, is a big idea for the future of trade. The planned route, picked to be fast and good for the environment, would be 160 miles long, connecting the Red Sea to the Mediterranean. This huge project would go right through the Negev Desert, changing the land and creating new jobs along the way. The canal would start at the Gulf of Aqaba, a good spot to reach the Red Sea and the Indian Ocean. From there, it would go through the Arava Valley, a place known for farms and pretty deserts. Then, it would go through the tough Negev Desert, showing how smart the engineers are. Finally, it would reach the Mediterranean Sea, near the Gaza Strip. This spot is great for shipping because it connects to routes going to Europe, Africa and other places. The canal's path was carefully planned to avoid bothering existing roads and nature. It's a mix of big dreams and being careful about the environment, building something this big will be tough, but Israel is good at big projects and new ideas, so they're ready for the challenge. The Ben Gurion Canal isn't just a line on a map, it shows how clever people are and how trade might work in the future. Reshaping global trade, the economic and strategic impact. The Ben Gurion Canal isn't just a cool engineering project, it could change the world of trade. Its impact would go way beyond Israel, changing shipping routes, how we trade, and who's in charge in the Middle East. This project could create new jobs, make trade faster, and make the whole system stronger. For Israel, the Ben Gurion Canal would be really valuable. It would make Israel a center for world trade, bringing in money, creating jobs, and helping the economy grow. Building the canal would also create new industries and encourage new ideas in engineering, shipping and transportation. For other countries, the Ben Gurion Canal would give a faster, cheaper and safer way to ship things than the Suez Canal. This would be good for businesses and shoppers, making things cheaper, getting them to us faster, and making sure we get what we need. Having another canal would also make shipping companies compete with each other, which means lower prices and better service. The Ben Gurion Canal is also important for political reasons. It would make Israel more important in the world, strengthen its friendships with other countries, and give it more power in the Middle East. The canal would also encourage countries to work together and keep things peaceful because everyone would want it to work smoothly. Navigating challenges, costs, politics, and the environment. The Ben Gurion Canal is a great idea, but it has challenges. It's a huge project that will cost a lot of money, over $100 billion. This means they'll need to find clever ways to get the money and plan carefully. Besides money, there are political problems too. 
The canal goes through an area with lots of tension so they'll need to talk to other countries and be very careful. Getting everyone to agree and making sure it's safe will be really important. The environment is also important. Building and using the canal could affect the desert, so they'll need to study those effects carefully and find ways to protect nature. They'll need to think about how much water it will use, how it will affect animals, and how to prevent pollution. Even with these challenges, the Ben Gurion Canal could be really good. Making it happen will take hard work, smart planning, and being careful about the environment. But because it could change trade so much and be so important for Israel, it's worth trying.